Hey, what's up, guys? As you can see by those videos that I'm here at the Tennessee Aquarium, and this is the thing that I was telling you guys about, or leading on to, because I thought it'd be a good vlog of, like, time lapses of the fish and stuff like that. I've never been here before, so it should be a fun thing to do. And after, we're, we're gonna watch an IMAX movie, and then we're also gonna, gonna go on, it's called a duck boat ride, where we, like, tour the city, and then it goes on a huge boat ramp and then goes straight down into the water because it's meant to drive on land and water. They were used in like on D-Day and World War II. So we just got out of the river section of the Tennessee Aquarium and now we're, our boat ride is in like 30 minutes or something. So we're pr just gonna walk around. We're gonna like get a charger back of the car. And then, so we're gonna go on the duck boat ride, which I'm pretty sure goes through the city and then goes in the water. And then after that, we're gonna go back, we're gonna eat and then go back to the aquarium and look at the ocean section. So that should be some more colorful, better videos. Now, I've, I've worked at the Ducks since since 2005. Now, I've been down this boat ramp, I don't know, a million times. Ready right, to go? Okay, hang on, hang on, Ohio. And now, do you, do you remember when I said get out? This is where I get rid of the Buckeyes right here. This is where I get rid of the Buckeyes. <laughs>
just took a walk down there by the coast. Uh, hopefully got some good videos and stuff. And now we're walking to the IMAX uh, movie that we're about to watch. And then after, we may go back to the aquarium. Chattanooga and now we're heading home and there's some outlets along the way home that we may go to uh, and see if they're still open. They may have closed already because it's like 6.30 and because they're farther out they may have closed already. The clips that you just saw were of us on a pedestrian bridge that was like really old and it was actually used for cars but then it, and it was going to be destroyed but then they raised money to save it keep it for pedestrians we just made it and this one's about an hour away from our house and it seems like it's a lot better it's a lot uh, more stores and stuff so better store. this should be good hopefully their selection of shoes and stuff is better too got out the nike outlet it was actually a nike factory store and those are uh, better than normal Nike outlets. I got some Air Max Tavises, which were like university red and then gray and white. So, and they were only $55, normally they're 85. And then I also got a drawstring bag. Now we're about to go into Justice or something for my sister. I'm back home from Tennessee now, which was a super far drive. And uh, at the Nike store, at the Nike factory store, I got this sweet uh, white and black drawstring bag, and I really needed a new one because I had this other one that was like lacrosse, and it's really ripped up, so I even had to duct tape the side a few days ago, so this is good because it's bigger, and I can carry some like camera stuff because it seems like it's a little more padded, and uh, gym clothes for school and lacrosse stuff. Then I got some shoes, uh, Air Max Tavises for a really good deal. They were only $55. They're normally like $85. That says retail, and I think I saw them even more expensive somewhere else. So I got these in the like university red, gray, and white. And so they're pretty fresh and fi. So yeah, I can't wait to wear these. And these are my first pair of Air Maxes. I've been eyeing them and I've really wanted them. I like that air bubble right there. It's gonna be, they're gonna be really comfortable. And I'm gonna custom lace them too. I'm watching a video right now. Uh, it's probably like how you would lace Roshis and stuff, which I already know how to do, but I'm just gonna see if they do it any differently. Thanks for watching this vlog, uh, vlog number 12. I'm pretty sure we're on 12 or 13. Uh, I really love making these vlogs, and they're really fun to make, um, and especially today's one. Today's one, uh, I hope I got some good material for it. I think I got a good, um, shots of, like, the fish and jellyfish and stuff. I also hope I got some good shots of the, like, boats and stuff going by. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next vlog.